What's up? My name is Technobo here for Server Pro and welcome to our Valheim tutorial series. In this series, I'll be showing you how to set up and run a Valheim server. This video covers giving yourself admin on your own Valheim server. If you don't already have yourself a Valheim dedicated server and you'd like to get one, click the I in the top right hand corner of this video to learn how to set one up for yourself. So first of all, navigate to your My Servers page on your Server Pro dashboard. Then navigate across to the control panel for your VPS server. If you want to learn how to create a new VPS or you're not entirely sure what one is, click the I in the top right hand corner of this video or check the description down below that'll take you to a video on how to get started. Then simply select the Valheim service and of course if you don't have the Valheim dedicated server installed on your server pro VPS, once again check the description down below for that video. When you're on this page, simply head across to the file section on the left hand side and open up the config folder. Then we'll be opening up the admin list.txt file over here. Inside of here, all we have to do is enter one Steam ID per line. The Steam ID will be the Steam ID of the player that you'd like to give admin. If you're not too sure how to get your own Steam ID, there's two ways of doing it. One, using your profile link and external websites, or two, arguably the simpler one, is heading across to the shell tab and then leaving this open while you connect to the server. After you connect, you should be able to quit out of your server and have a look at the console once again. Such as here, here is my Steam ID. I can simply double click to copy it, head across to files once again, config, admin list, and paste it into a new line here. The second way of doing this is by using a site like steamid.uk. You can simply head across to your profile page, copy the page URL, and then use a website like steamid.uk. Paste in your URL and click search. After searching, you should find your Steam ID down here, right next to Community ID. Simply paste it in on a new line, but of course mine's already there. I'll simply click Save File and head back to the Dashboard section. Then simply click the Restart button in the top right hand corner and after your server restarts, you should have full admin powers on the server. We'll see that in just a moment. And after we connect to the server, we can hit F5 and type something like banned to see a list of banned players. And instead of receiving an error, you see it just works. But anyways, I hope this tutorial was helpful. If you have any video suggestions, leave them in the comments below. If you're having issues with anything, contact our support team. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.